Hi folks, thank you for tuning in to Mini Orange. This video will walk you through steps to configure skim provisioning between Azure AD and Drupal. Make sure you have the Mini Orange user provisioning module installed on your Drupal site. You can refer to the setup guide of installation from the link given in the description. Click on Mini Orange user provisioning under the configuration section of the admin console. Under Changes from Provider to Drupal Skim Server, click on Configure button. Copy the Skim Base URL. Now, let's create an application in the Azure AD. Log into the Azure AD portal and click on the Enterprise Application. Click on the New Application button. Now, click on Create Your Own Application button. Enter the application name. From the What Are You Looking section, select the third option and click on the Create button. Now, let's configure provisioning between Azure AD and Drupal. Click on the Provision User Accounts button. Now, click on the Get Started button. From the Provisioning Mode drop-down select Automatic. Paste the copied skim base URL under the tenant URL text field. Navigate back to the Drupal site and copy the skim bearer token. Navigate back to the Azure portal and paste the bearer token into the secret token text field. Click on the test connection button. Let's assign users to the Azure AD application. Click on the assign users and groups. Click on the add user slash group. Now, click on the None Selected link under the Users. Search for the user and select it. Now, click on the Select button. Once the user is selected, click on the Assign button. Let's see how provisioning works between Azure AD and Drupal. Navigate to the Provisioning section. Click on Provision on Demand. Search for the user to be provisioned and select it. Click on the Provision button. The user has been successfully provisioned to the Drupal site. Let's check if the user is created on the Drupal site. Navigate to the People section. You can see the user has been successfully provisioned. If you got something out of this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any queries or concerns, you can reach out to us at drupalsupport at securify.com. Thanks for watching.